Do you want to do my intro for me? Do you want to speak to the masses? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing another plus size fashion. <laughs> In today's video, we're doing another plus size fashion video, and I'm showing you guys three different outfits that you could wear and rock as we're transitioning from winter to spring. You know that really awkward phase where it's like. Are you gonna be hot today or are you gonna be cool today? Or is it just both and you just don't know what to wear? These are pieces that I think are just the perfect transitional items um, to carry you over into the spring season. So without further ado, if you guys want to see this video, just keep on watching. Really quick, I make plus size fashion and beauty related videos like this one. So if you're into that kind of stuff, go ahead and click that red button down below. And all right, now we can get started. <laughs> is one of my favorite looks to wear um, the thing about building a wardrobe this is one of the new items that I picked up I purchased from Abercrombie and Fitch but I've had these other items for years now and that's the thing about building a wardrobe it's finding a color scheme that you love and then picking items that match within that color scheme that way when you do have other items in your wardrobe, you can easily create more outfits because they all kind of match. And having something like this, when I saw this on Abercrombie, I saw this color and it's a color that I love to wear. And I mean, I have like nude shoes, I have these satin pants, this is from Walmart. Like these are all the colors I, I think of and keep in my closet. That way when I do pick up new items, these are like essential pieces that I could wear throughout the year mine summer and this is something that I can wear like for example for spring it gives me enough layers to keep me warm when it's still a little bit cool outside but if anything I could always take this vest off if it gets a little too warm so this is one of the items that I picked up specifically for spring from Abercrombie and this is the outfit that I put together that I really 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 like outfit number one let's go to outfit number two Okay, so this is outfit number two. Oh, I love this outfit. Yo, how cute is she? What? So this is another piece that I picked up from Abercrombie & Fitch. Obviously, this is still such a winter look, but this is my, this is a great winter going into spring outfit. One thing about spring or that transition time is cardigans. So this cardigan is another one that I picked up from Abercrombie & Fitch. I just love this like pattern. I think it's so classy. And so because it's like a thick oversized cardigan, the beauty about it is that when it gets warmer, you can take this off um, or you can keep it on. So the way I had it is... I have a white button up that I got from Reb Dolls. It is linen, it is great quality. One of my like, like this is such a staple piece to have. And then I have my Spanx faux leather leggings. If you have seen my other videos, you know that I freaking love these. I've been wearing these for years now. It's held up so well. It's one of my like go-to pieces for basically every season but summer. And then I just have some white booties on. These are pieces, like everything that I have on, are staple wardrobe pieces because I can mix and match and wear these in so many other outfits and wear in multiple seasons. But this is how I would wear, this is how I would wear this outfit when we're transitioning from winter to spring. Every outfit or every item that I have, I'll do my best and link it down below in the description. So if you guys wanna shop this video, you can go ahead and do that. Um, also, I guess let me show you how this would look without the cardigan. So say it heats up and it's like super hot and I'm like, all right, this gotta go. I'll just take this bad boy off. Like, do you see how different it looks without the belt? It's just an oversized cardigan this off and if anything I might just tuck it in a little bit apple shaped bodies where y'all at so if I got really hot I just took off my cardigan and I tucked in the front that in the back and this is the outfit so and if it gets cold again I would put that cardigan back up one of the other things that I have on are these sunglasses. These sunglasses are from Amazon. 
pulls the outfit together as far as accessories. Also for this video, I kept it very simple with accessories with these gold hoops. I think you just can't go wrong with that. Um, and then right now I have these sunglasses. And that's it. All right, next outfit. All right, y'all. So this is the third and final outfit that I have on. <laughs> okay. Starting off, I have a crew neck from Abercrombie & Fitch. We're keeping with the neutrals, black, white, gray, slash, all of that. Um, and so the pants that I have, I love these pants. I love how big and like wide they are. I, I just, I really, really love them. Um, and I love the look of having like super wide pants and then like my white sneakers peeking out love this look um so the way i have it is i have the crew neck tucked in a little bit if you haven't seen my last video it's a venus haul and this is where i picked up these pants from i freaking love it these are so comfortable so this is perfect for like i think especially going into spring when it's still a little chilly but it's like super loose fitting and just very comfortable oh i forgot my collar dicky so this is a great way to layer without actually having to layer um, all I did was I put my black collar dicky underneath it so it seems like I layered it a little bit um, but we all know layering is <laughs> not as fun when it starts to warm up the less layers the better especially if you don't want to feel bulky or having extra things on this is perfect for that and yeah this is the outfit purse i've had also for years it's from aldo um it's actually a side purse but i just but i went ahead and i tucked in the longer straps and i'm holding on to the gold belt like so and that is it that is the outfit and for anyone who comes at me for tucking things in i don't care i i just love how this looks and i don't care if my belly is apple shaped and sticks out I just like how this looks, so I'm just gonna roll with it if you don't want to have it fully tucked in. And for those of you who don't want to have it fully tucked in, I went ahead and took out all of it and I just have it tucked in just a little bit underneath um, in the front, but that's how it would look. But overall, this is one of those comfy pieces that I just freaking, freaking love. If you can, please give this video a thumbs up to let YouTube know you guys like it and find these videos actually helpful. Um, also, if you haven't joined the family, no pressure. But if you want to, you know, the red button's right there. Um, all right, you guys. Other than that, I will see you guys next time.